So dear friends and colleagues from the African Stroke Organization, we are delighted to hear that this is now being reality. And we want to offer our heartfelt congratulations and friendship. The World Stroke Organization has been established in 2006, and it is the only global organization focused on stroke. It is an umbrella for more than 50 uh, scientific organizations and more than 100 stroke support organizations. We have 4,000 plus individual members. We have consultative status for the United Nations and the World Health Organization. We are partner member of the NCD Alliance and we are a founding member of the Global Coalition for Circulatory Health. We know that 14 million strokes occur every year, large part probably in your region, in Africa, and 80 million people live with the consequences of stroke, also a large part in Africa. So we have developed projects and methods to prevent every other stroke and probably one in three cases of dementia. So I think our activity should be developed further, needs a lot of support, and uh, we will see how this works out in the future together with the African Stroke Organization, which is the last big organization on a very large continent which develops this kind of organization. As you know, we are also hosting the World Stroke Campaign worldwide. And uh, last year and this year, it has the slogan, one in four, don't be the one, which means one in four adult people will, during their lifetime, suffer a stroke somewhere in the world. And don't be the one means try to modify your behavioral risk factors, and then you will not be this one person in four. The World Stroke Day is now coming up, and I hope that also the, our friends in the African Stroke Organization will be active in this respect. We have the World Stroke Academy, which is an online learning platform, which uh, contains a repository of uh, important lectures and educational incentives that are freely available for all members. We are hosting the International Journal of Stroke, which you might know is the Global Stroke Journal, and it is already high ranking since several years. We are also organizing the World Stroke Congress every other year, and from, next, from this year on it will be annually. So this year's Congress coming up on November uh, 7 to 9, and I uh, hope that many of you will be attending and I'll see you there. A lot of other meetings, regional meetings in various places are, are being held. We are also developing a global stroke agenda, which is a very important thing together with the World Health Organization. We are, we are trying to um, fulfill our mission uh, to uh, reduce the burden of stroke together with like-minded people that are um, in, in the um, uh, area of the World Health Organization. Finally, we have uh, developed uh, stroke guidelines, and these stroke guidelines are uh, well received, and we endorse them uh, if, they are, have, if they have global usefulness. So there was a roadmap for quality stroke care, which we endorsed and has been found quite useful around the world. And finally, the global stroke support organizations are under our umbrella, I must say, that these are extremely important and extremely effective. If you want to change things, you have to um, team up with support organizations and um, make them part of your work and mission. So altogether, you can see that the World Stroke Organization is a very comprehensive organization and works on many levels. We offer our friendship and support to the African colleagues, 
and will be delighted to develop regular contacts, regular conferences together in the future. Thank you.